our first 10 minute spread of day one in Macau. 10 minutes on the game clock, 12 seconds shot clock has begun, and off we go from Macau. Doc Strange up top, Vidoc with the rock, I think not. He misses it shy off the front iron, comes around. Kandava Toriba with their new ad. And that one is deflected. At least 4.7 seconds left on the shot clock. And that's enough for Martins Krumins. I don't think any relation to Edgar's Krumins. Oh, gone with the win. He made Doc Strange see vapors with that first step as the 23 year old lays it in. Strange takes the two, he'll miss. Rymo, the rebounding machine, can't squeeze it. Quick ball movement from Maestro. He'll find a wide open Barach, and that one is spit out. Barach will foul. He's got a couple of good looks from two range. And Nemanja has, has had a great season, as you would expect. But check out this reverse lay. His layup package is improving. Martins Krumitz. Kandaba, a draw first blood. Edgar's Krubitz, one of the sharpest shooters to touch a 3x3. Wilson will miss fire on his first attempt. Maestrovic, lofting inside, Badaj position, falling away, and over three is the start for Nim Diesel. He need to get that premium fuel. He got unleaded right now. He's putting 87 in. Got to get that 90, 95. It's 91 in the States, but I think in Europe it's, isn't it 95? Anyway, ball movement leads to that score from Doc Strange. Buck apiece, Krumitz up fake, cross court. The other Krumitz hangs and nearly hits, couldn't get the tip, Rymo, no. So tip drilling is Kandava. Uh oh, yeah. Stepped on the line, also kind of shuffled his feet, too. So that's an easy whistle from official Pedro. Take another look at that last score. You know, Oob like to spread it around. Stojicic assessing, kicking it up to Rakila. Ooh, no. There's Balac. High percentage attempt there. Look at that skip dish. My goodness, Krumitz delivering 2-2. Two -two. Stojicic steps back, wanted some space in the relationship. It's over between us. 3-2, no 4-2, after the two from the doctor. Kandava. Right back. Oh, nice action. You can tell the veteranship of Krumen's presence on this Kandava team is making a difference. Lotsis is an emerging star. Rymo is uh, also on his way up. I think that Olympic experience did, did them some good. Started off undefeated in group play. I, don't, I hate to remind, I'm not trying to rub it in, but I just got to tell the story and uh, ended up not medally, lost to Lithuania for the bronze medal. Branquila, stroke was broke, he'll get it back. Offensive rebound, second attempt. Get shifty with it, gave him a trick and a tree. Halloween is, is that later this month? Yes, it is. <laughs> I forgot what month it was. It is, it is October. He went trick or treat. <laughs> 5-3, Raimo is bumped. Team foul here, number three. 721. Two and a half in, two point lead for Ubuishanini. Raimo, Krumitz, Krumitz straight on, okay. two piece to the hand. Five a piece. Maestro wants to fire back, it'll miss that time and out of bounds. Although my sort of is did have a really good tournament in uh, Amsterdam. I wouldn't expect him to miss many of those, but look at Krumitz. You want to talk about rapid fire. Rapid fire. Edgar's Krumitz still in the corner and still getting the job done. Krumitz drops it off. Lots is from way out there. 
Kromitz. Kromitz, quick step. Misses it. Oh, and he won it. He wanted the whistle. He's not happy about it. And official Briggy will give him a warning. Not re not in the mood to hear any complaints. TB timeout. Edgar's crewman, 39 years young. What a 3x3 career he has had. Long time member of Riga. Of course, with Agnes Chavars and Norris Miezis and Carlos Lasmanis uh, for many years. Sustained some injuries and took a licking and kept on ticking. Speaking of ticking, there's a bomb from Strahini. You see what I did there? That's just wordplay on the fly. I just, I mean, sharp this morning. Let's see how long it lasts. <laughs> 55. Three minutes in. Oh, actually, it was not a warning. He got he got hit with that technical. A tech indeed assessed to Edgar's crewman's as Brankovic will knock it down. Oob trending up on the free throw line, too, by the way. You know, that they didn't miss a single free throw in Amsterdam. 16 of 16, Strahinia, the pace. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, cross, Rymo. Oh, was looking for Lotsis on the back door. They weren't on the same page. They'll turn it over. Well, that last, that last layup from Dr. Strange goes past two defenders. And just that slight slow down or slowing down near the bucket, allowing the score. He'll score it again. And that's a good sign for Strahinia, who got off to a slow start in Amsterdam. He, he averaged only 2.3 points per game in group play. Now, he really picked it up day two. Meantime, he didn't pick it up. He dropped him off. Edgar's Krumitz, pass Branquila. Touch pass from Badac is broken up. Four seconds left. Top two from each group advance to the quarterfinals if you are new to 3x3. So 12 teams will go down to eight by the end of business today. There's a $40,000 grand prize at stake. 9-6, ooh. Up top, Raimo, uncontested lay. Maestro, three-man weave. Now Badat from long range. He has not had the stroke. Krumitz, aggressive in this game so far. His team within striking distance as Mike Stoinovic will get called for Oob's fourth foul. Great body control there from Raimon, the fake handoff. Little rub screen. Same sort of action now. Krumen just uses that wide body to clear some space in the other Krumen's. It's a Krumen's Krumen's connection. Somebody tell me if they relate it, but their names are spelled differently, so you can't blame me. Krumen's and Krumen's. I'm sure that's wrong. Strange trying to get fancy at the rim. He's able to draw the foul. So, Doc Strange, how, how good was he day two in Amsterdam? An 11-point semifinal explosion over Raudan Varis, Hop Trans, and six points in the final. And he connects at the free throw line. So, Oob have made their last 18 free throws, if you're keeping count. Don't worry if you don't, I will. Stojicic, what in the world was that? Raimo thought about the two. He ain't got to worry about it. You ain't got to tell Krumans to shoot twice. He will miss it. And Krumans is going to need a rest. The 39-year-old will check out, and the 25-year-old will come in. His legs are 14 years fresher. They still don't get a shot up in time. So midway through in a 10-8 game, it is Oob in front. 
The Serbians with a 30 and 9 record this year. And they average about 20 points per game. Halfway through, they're halfway there. That package dropped off, and Mike Stortovich had the wrong address. Couldn't deliver. No connection on the alley oop. Doc Strange quickly turns the corner. That is definitely a, a bump, a hip check right there. So Sirahinia is slow to get up, but oh yeah. He's going to feel that later. Shooting one. Doc Strange. The team shooting 71% from the line this year. Strahinia. Good. He is the world's number one player, in case you didn't know. Oh, nice fake. The ball fake opened up the lane for Raimo, and Raimo nearly got the steal. And now I get my first assist at the tournament. There you go, Pedro. Another look at that last bucket from Raimo. Barac gets him started. Tranquila up top. My stroke. My stroke. It's his stroke, but I wish it was mine. 13 to 9. My Stortovich. My, my, my. That man can shoot. 420. Barac on the attack. Muscle against muscle. Needs some cartilage in between those two. That was a biology uh, bar. <laughs> Boz is rolling his eyes right now. I know he is. <laughs> Drop down to Lotsis. 13-10. Ooh, have not been able to get any big lead here, but they've certainly done enough to stay in front. 14-10. TV timeout. If you want to get yourself some 3x3 apparel, some gear, go to FIBA3x3-shop.com. You can also uh, purchase a Wilson ball. That is our, our ball sponsor, obviously. Big thank you to all of our friends at Wilson. Excuse me there. That's what I have a talk back button for. As well as our official timekeeper, Maurice Lacroix. Under four minutes. Ranquila to Maestro. Uh-oh. Brankovic is holding his chin. He doesn't hold back shooting the two. He does miss the mark. Watsis couldn't show him how it was done. A little long on his attempt. Strange. Baseline. Kick. Maestrovic. So a couple of missed twos for U. A team that shot at 37% from distance just last weekend. 37%. That's, that's really good in 3x3, particularly because this game is played outdoors. Crewman's. Well, actually, it's Badac that's going to get whistled for that foul. That's the now fifth on U. So with 3.20 to go. Ooh, we've been in front for the duration of this game outside of Kandava getting the first score of the contest. Ever since then, it's been all ooh. But the lead is not safe. That'll count plus the foul. I like this new ad. Martins Krumitz. Look at the elevation. He, he tried to yoke on him. If he hadn't been fouled, he might have threw that down. Love his athleticism, explosive going to the rim. He's 23 years old. And he's having an impact. So much so that Kandava is within two. Grumans trying to help Kandava pull off an upset and get their first win over Oob. Not like that they won't. Inside, Badach is able to locate the Wilson. And he muscles his up, way up and in. Uh-oh. 
They mishandle it. And Doc Strain says, let's get reset. Up top to Maestro. Feed to Badach. Badach makes the extra pass. Oh, but Strange couldn't deliver. If you don't succeed, try, try again. He'll get reloaded after back-to-back -back misses from two. Majstorovic using the screen, trying to use the pick and roll instead, the floating. Had a little too much sauce on it. It comes out, approaching two minutes. Kandava looking to pull within the possession, but hold up, wait a minute. Travels call. So, who won a timeout? Game one of the day. Kondapa putting forth a pretty, pretty good effort, I gotta say. And are hanging right in this game. So the wins for Oud this year in Demerson, in Chengdu, and in Amsterdam. Doc Strange goes to another gear. Four-point game. Make that a three-point game. Kandava, quick response. Rankovic letting Stojicic. Try to pick this defense apart. Bronkila, left stroke, no. Has a little collision with Krumitz. Krumitz, no sir. Brankovic with the rebound. Brankovic, no sir. Loose ball will land with Brankovic. A little behind the back action underneath to Badac. Minute 20, Kandava not out of this yet. They gotta find a way to knock down a two. Still searching. So 71 seconds remaining. Another look at the skip dish on the baseline from Bronquilla. And he stuffs that one, that's Dr. Strange. Now, the, wow, usually that's one that Bronquilla would make. Perfect pass from Stojicic. Speaking of perfect passes, Raimo with the delivery. Lotsis makes it 17-14, too physical. That'll be the sixth on Kandava. They had a foul to give. Actually, they did not. That is their seventh. And is there seven? So Brankovic trying to extend the streak. Oh, well, prior to that miss, they had made 18 in a row. 18 of 19 is not bad. But they are no longer streaking. They got their clothes on. Stop giggling. Stop giggling. Oh, Edgar's crew for two. It is just a two-point game. Brankovic can't find the bottom of the net. Wait a second. Martin's goal. He had a great look. That's the look that matters late in the game. Good steal here. And Krumens, the other Krumens, didn't have the confidence to shoot it. Edgar's will. And the veteran will miss. Three seconds separate the game clock and shot clock. Ooh, trying to use some clock. Oh, Maestrovic misses. Raimo can tie it. Two ball on the way. Whoa, he stepped on the line. Are you kidding? Forget about the shot. It wouldn't have counted if it went because he stepped on the line. Kandava had every opportunity. Every opportunity to tie this game, to even potentially take the lead. And they continually let the, let those chances slip right through their fingers. So, look, they had their chances. 
and their chance has now come to an end. That bucket counts. That will officially make the final 19-16. 19-16 in favor of Ooh. That will be the 31st win on the season. As they keep things rolling, 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 rolling.